All right, David with Bulwars Plumbing at 414 East 5th Street in the basement bathroom here making dirty movies. Currently at about 108 feet. This is your city tap here. I'm gonna start backing you up, maybe. <laughs> uh, clay line exterior the whole way. Um, typical clay line stuff, got some offsets, uh, standing water. Um, my biggest concern actually is the standing water. So most of it is not very deep. We are actually have standing water pretty much through the entirety of this line. Um, most of what you're seeing hanging down there is actually cobwebs. I didn't really see any roots coming through. Um, the issue with the standing water is that it's an indicator that doesn't have proper flow, proper drainage. Um, we might have a little bit of root growth in here. Um, probably not enough to justify a clean though. I may, I'm gonna, Look, I'm gonna look at this on the bigger screen. I may recommend a chemical treatment on the line, but that would be the extent as far as the roots go. Uh, like I said, there's a lot of standing water here. Um, the issue with that is obviously if it's holding water, it can start holding solids as well, and you start having backup issues. Um, like I said, I'm gonna have the uh, service manager look at this as well. We'll look at it on a bigger screen and kind of get a better idea of what's going on. Particularly deep, so we may just notate that it's there. I mean, if this were, you know, up over the camera for an extended, you know, or anything like that, I would definitely recommend that being repaired. I really don't think we're going to recommend a repair on this line. I think more than likely we're just going to, you know, want people to know that it's there. Everywhere I'm seeing is, you know, less than an inch of standing water in here. Right there, we made our transition at the edge of the house. I'm gonna go from the clay line to a cast iron line underneath the concrete slab. Um, this cast iron is not too bad. I mean, you start to get some scale build up in here. It's really not in bad shape. I'm not seeing any channeling or anything like that in the line, so I think we'll go ahead and just leave this cast iron alone for now. There you'll see that three inch clean down. I went down here in between the toilet and the shower stall. And up there you got a little hallway there. There's the bedroom stuff around the corner. Vanity behind me here. Well, again, David with Bowler Plumbing at 414 East 5th.